is up guys? It's your boy Lone Star, Diecast Exotics. Today we're cracking open our Diecast cars. What's up, Jeep Lover? Welcome to the live stream today. I'm finally deciding to crack open my cars with my knife here because this is how I open them. Like, okay, so we're gonna crack open this. Who went? This, we're gonna crack open this baby. I instead of like uh, ripping the cars like like that, like I just put the knife through here. Just watch this. Carefully do it like that. Go under the grooves carefully. I think I should. What's up, Robert King? Welcome to the live stream. It's been a long time since you've been here. It's been since, I don't know, like January 2nd since you've been here, Robert. But uh, I saw you on uh, PTR's uh, streaming. Wait. Does he still have that thing that stream offline? I don't know if he still has it offline or not, but. Uh, oh gosh, it went under. I think I put it a little bit too under. Oh gosh. I'm just trying to crack open my cars from Walgreens. I'm not going to crack open that super anytime. No, 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 no. I ain't cracking that super. Super DeLorean, I love. We don't need roads where we're going. But, uh. We're cracking open the Fairly Z next. Uh. uh okay, the Fairly Z is going to go in the collection. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we already cracked open the Guapzilla. And it's terrible. I mean, it's nice. Is that from that? I already put tail lights in there. Very nice walking through that. I already put I'm putting it on my T1 transporter brother. Dang. Now the group found one of these with the air. Huh. That does the air up first. I was like, what the What's up XX Connor? XX Diecast. How what have you been doing? Welcome to the stream. Be sure to like. And we're just cracking open my cards from Walgreens. This one is a fairly Z. I still need the super version of this one. No, this is not a super. Last 2017 was a super, but set that aside. Crack open the Porsche 918 Spider. Nothing really. Yeah, I found the Super DeLorean. Yeah, I've noticed you've been busy lately, but uh, yeah, I'm cracking open the Porsche. I'm gonna crack it open carefully, guys. Ready? Oh, oh. ouch. Whoa. Dang, this Porsche is pretty nice. <laughs> what, where's the deck on? Oh, wait. It looks smat, but it's actually gloss. Dang, this Porsche is nice. This is actually the. This actually reminds me of something when the Porsche, real Porsche, the debut came out. It showed off at the auto show in Germany. This is the same deco that it came in. This is the racing version of it. The snow stat. Now, at first, I thought they get rid of the back deco at first. I was going to be like, don't do that. But then they were like, yeah, the details right here. I, I, in, the, in the pack, in the uh, nine pack when I saw it, I was like, oh, no, don't tell me they removed it. But then I saw it in the pack, a single pack. I was like, wow, very nice. And just like the car you buy from the store, I love the fresh Hot Wheels car smell. Right out of the package, I smell them because it just smells so fresh. No, I'll crack open this beautiful Porsche 917 LH here. I'm gonna crack it open with the knife again. I think I might crack open my supers like this. Ooh, I just hit the car. Crap. There you go. The best way to like get your cards near mint while cracking them open is use the knife. Nice Porsche. I have the golf version. I think this thing is really nice, actually. I'm not going to crack open the soup unless I found another one. I mean, this Porsche is really detailed. I mean, oh, whoa. What was this? What's that? Yeah, I'm getting, I'm like, I'm going to put them back in the package and hang them on my wall pretty soon. But is that an air? Guys, I think I found an air. Right there. Paint air. What? 
They ain't got ears. Like most of my cars are crack open have minor ears. My Camaro had the same air. That's minor. Like if the paint was like all over the side, I'd consider that major, brother. This Porsche is really nice. Love it. Crack open two Porsches. Oh, I've been waiting to crack open this one. Trail Boss LT. I kind of like the red one. This is like the second recolor of it so far. Oh gosh, it's going to be a bad cracker. Oh, yep, it's going to be a bad cracker. I'm not going to bother doing that. Alright. Oh, yeah, there you go. Ooh. Wow. Dang, this thing is nice. I have, I have a, a errors. The, the, uh. I have a 57 Chevy Elver a Chevy 57 Chevy it has an air on it. What the? Wait, I cracked open an air. You have got to be kidding me. I did not just crack open an air. I'll go check that out, G Blubber. I forgot. I didn't see it yet, but I'll see it later, man. After I do the live stream, I'm going back on Instagram again. But uh, do you see that? Oh my god, why is it? Uh, okay, is this a minor error or is this a major? Some people call this minor error. Dang, if they if they just take off the side tampos except this and make it black. Man, I would be really happy to see this. Man, this is really dope. Man, I love this trail boss. Look how shiny it is. Very shiny car. Now we're gonna crack open the third, another Porsche. We have too many Porsches. The new Porsche 911. I have like, oh, like we did a live stream about my air cars like a couple days back. Oh my gosh, this one's gonna be a bad crack in the wheel. I'm gonna crack open this one. Okay. I'm gonna put the knife under there. Whoa. Ooh, that was a bad air. I mean, that was a bad cracking, I mean. Oof. Mm. This Gale wants to be stubborn. Oh, there she is. There she is. Hey, guys. Glizia Porsche. If this, I hope to see this as a super, because if it's a super, I mean, the TH will probably be back there. Right there. And also, this there's this new 911 Carrera. All right, Jeep lovers, see you later, man. Thanks for joining the stream. Be sure to like. I'll, I'll see that picture on Instagram. Don't worry about that, but uh, it is. If y'all seen that new Porsche that came out this year, it got recolored in blue. I don't know where it got recolored in blue. Still haven't seen a packaged one yet, but uh, really hoping to see one. But uh, man, that car smell really smells good. All right, crack open this. Uh, right now we're gonna crack open this one. I have all the variations of this one. I still gotta get the open track one and the blue one, but uh. Really love this color on this one. Oh no! I just cracked that one open. Like the blister wants to like rip off on me or something. Mm. Like to do customs, you need to do one of the two things. One, the way most people do, they use nail polish. Or two, they get a knife. No, there's actually three ways. One, they get nail polish, which is the most common. Yeah, that's how I do. I actually do that. Surprisingly, I found out how to do that, but uh, yeah. And also, and three, Drifter D does it by slicing the blister open. Yeah, this thing is nice. I didn't ever get over like underestimating this thing, but this thing is nice. I love the energy on the wing too. Really nice car. Mm -mm -mm. Really nice looking guy. Dodge Charger Stock Car. I don't know how this guy's gonna be cracked up. Oh, this thing's a little bit mint. This is from the EK. Oh. Oh, yeah, that the Mercedes Benz and Leo. That one. Ugh. With my supers, I'd be really careful. I'm not gonna crack that Super DeLorean anytime. Oh, the AMG, that one. Oh yeah, that one's pretty nice actually. Yeah. Making sure there's no errors. I'm not gonna crack open my Super DeLorean that hover mode because I found that at Walgreens. No, I'm not gonna crack it open unless I find another one on a bad card. 
for it on the good card, and that one can get cracked away. This thing doesn't even look like a car, it's a Dodge Charger at first. This thing doesn't even look like a Dodge Charger at first. Until you look on the bottom and it says... Christ, I think it says... Wait. This is a regular NASCAR. Look at all the logos on that thing. Really nice. Really nice, nice, nice. Now let's get on to these guys. I've been waiting to crack open both of these guys forever. If Diecast Cars Garage, Garage was here, he'd be happy to see me crack these over. This is the 6-7 Jeepster Commando. Oof. Look at the Dodge. Ooh, that was a bad opening. Ay ay ay. Ouch. Whoa. Dang, this thing feels bigger than it looks. Big ass. Bike on the back. 2018 Mattel. Man, this thing is pretty nice. Actually, I'm not even lying. Very nice. Love the Jeep. Now let's open that new Land Rover. I'm gonna open that new Land Rover right now. Land Rover Series 3 pickup right here. Alright, come on. Don't be a bad. Oh, he's a bad cracker. When I call them bad crackers, that means they're gonna be cracked open really badly, like, suck. Yeah. Yeah, it really does, actually. Alright, here we go. There it is. What? A nice freaking car. I love this one. You've got to love this one so much. This thing is just really nice. Like, suit. What is this? A little paint blob there. Love the Land Rover now for it. I hope to see this one as a super. Wait, is that? Uh, hopefully, this one is a super for the hot truck. So, if this one was a super, the TH would probably be either on the license plate. Or be right here. I hope to see this one as a super. I'm really hoping to see that one happen. Man, that Jeep is really dope. Look at that Jeep. Also, this one. I found that one car, but I didn't get it because I already have to look at that one. Slammer with this. Pretty dang nice. Dang, this is really nice. I would see this one and stuff. Indy? Man, I already opened the Guac Zilla, though. I already opened it. Really nice and Guapzilla though. It looks ugly though. And this trail boss though. Man, this is like the quickest life I've ever done. But I did a custom Ford Raptor. It looks normal at first until you uh look on the bot look on the back. The five hundred? Uh-huh, which one? Oh yeah, the ND five hundred oh yeah, the golf one. I have that one. But until you look at the back of this one, the reason why I wanted to customize this one. Dang, but a really nice car. I'll make Emba put riders on this one. Alright, I'm planning on putting riders on some of these cars. Like, why am I watching Snoopy? Oh my gosh. I need a rotating display table. I think this one, I'm going there. I got a whole pack of R35s in there. Let me just move these two intruders out. So, I'm gonna ask the Martin. Bye, Felicia. The, the, uh, BMW. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> I'm doing that, but there it goes. Yeah, yeah, I like doing that. Okay, guys. You may see some dramatic action here, but if this thing falls, it's not going to look pretty. We're going to have multiple casualties. We're going to take the other R34. Yeah, the GTR family. Oof. There we go. Okay, now we're going to plant it. I unlocked the passcode. 
The passcode to unlock this box is JDM. So you gotta put JDM. You can barely see the Quagzilla. Wait. I'll put it upside down. Nice. I put it upside down. Oh my gosh. So now we gotta wait. If the Guapzilla, I think this is the only color of the Guapzilla. They may let they may recolor it. Yeah, that one. They should actually do it though. But I think they may recolor it. I'm kind of thinking of something about it. Oh, I'm looking for any more JDM. We have too many JDMs. Oh wait. The friendly Z was a JDM. JDM. I gotta wait till I complete the whole Nissan set. I'm only looking for that Nissan Turbo and that's about it. So the cars, I'm only looking for that Nissan Turbo and now I'm done. I'm done. I think I might do a customization on the Audi Quattro. There she is. GTR 5 pack. I mean, oops, three pack. There he is, Diecast Cars Garage. What's up? You just missed it, but. Diecast Cars Garage. You just missed it, but we cracked open all my cars except that DeLorean from the Super. But we cracked open your Jeep, my, your favorite two cars, the Jeep and the Land Rover. And actually, the bike is more detailed than the car. Uh, Robert King says the bike is more detailed than the car, but uh. Need to go to Walmart, though, man. Yeah, if you want to go see the cracking, you can go ahead and like rewind the stream. I used my knife to open. I used this knife, but I just slid it under the blisters. Like, if if diecast in Z is here, I gotta tell him to suggest to use a knife to go under the blister. Or dude, like Drifter V does. The Land Rover is pretty. Nice. I want to see this one as a super. Is what I'm thinking. Like I have a strange feeling. This one is going to be the super of the hot trucks. Or if I see this Jeep as a super. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to see. I know the wheels will be the same wheels on that Mercedes Benz Unimog. But uh. Yeah we got the GTR 3 back. Oh look. That kind of looked like that super treasure hunt at first. Almost got fooled for that at first. But we might do a first customization. What is this? Oh, that's not an error. I thought that Mercedes Benz was an error. But uh. These are all the cars we cracked open. Wait, this Mercedes, this Jeep, this Porsche, two, three, all of the Porsches. Then you do a mainline Porsche series, the Porsche 19. Oh my gosh, I was like, my hand is getting really full. And this Land Rover, hold on. Balance, balance. There we go. That's a lot of a handful of cars. And this one I left in Walgreens because I've already had this one. Oh no, I dropped the Porsche. Guys, comment down below which car is your favorite. They need to do a Jeep set. Wait, who who's found who's found the Chevrolet truck series at Walmart? If I find that the, the Dodge Power Wagon has no metal base now, unfortunately. So, wah 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 wah. And I forgot what I did with the Porsche Porsches, but I, they're here somewhere. Oh, you found it yet? You found it. So we're gonna put Robert King. Did you find that set yet? So the Porsche. Three Porsches. Look at this Porsche family just growing. Gotta put these guys. Where's that Land Rover? Oh, it's over here. Oh yeah, this Silverado and that power wagon. The new power wagon. Oh my gosh, I love it. Yeah, the I still forgot the there's too many Porsche police cars. I realized something. We have not one but two Porsche police cars. Don't forget about the Porsche Panamera. The Porsche Panamera is a police car as well. We're gonna do a customization. I gotta put rear riders on the Audi Quattro Sport, my dudes. So I got this Audi here. We're gonna unrivet it. Oops. Real. Put the cars up there. Get the cards, which I cracked open. So that Mercedes Benz. Some of these cars are gonna get rear riders in the future, but uh, others will probably just be the same. So. Say so I also did a custom, I was working on a custom today, this is the Ford Raptor. What I did is I hollowed out this interior to make it look more real. Look at that. Now, I might actually slam it, but I gotta put smaller wheels on. I'm trying to look for like small wheels. Come on, what wheels fit? Guys, I'm trying to look for the wheels right now, like, when I do slam it, I mean, I'm trying to look for the wheels that will fit this truck. So far I'm looking at the Corvette, but uh... Let's get the customizations, shall we? 
You want to see the Audi being customized, right? You got to put it right there. Like that. I might actually customize off camera. But that Audi already have detail. It's got the front detail. And that's the back detail. Man, these tires, I got to... Oh, wait. I got more customs. I'm going to wheel swap something. Let me go get the wheel swap. I'm trying to make sure if it's going to fit or not, but who wants to see a customization live right now? Like, who wants to see it? I mean, it's okay if they don't want to see it or not. I mean, you can see the interesting complex of how we derivate cars and stuff, but, uh, wait, hold on. Before I do this, I do collect the straps. Yeah, I think Robert King is going to be right. This is going to take a long time, though, but I need to do premieres. I, haven't done, I need to do a premiere. I don't know how to yet, but I'll figure it out, hopefully. But, uh, yeah, this is what... Yeah, everyone's voting, so... Yeah, we're doing it. There we go. Yeah, it's dropping in there. I collect the shavings, and I melt them down to make body parts of cars and stuff. So I have my own furnace. I have very, I, I, the last time I used it was like a month ago. Don't want to over drill the car because sometimes what happens is that is that like if you overdo it, the once it does hit the if you keep on doing it for, for a lot of pressure, the rivet will come out somewhat like uh which where's that car that I did the rivet like all right. Yeah, I have, I'll do a video about that, but I have a car that somewhere that has that air that I don't, oh yeah, my T2 Pickup Custom Super, that had the air on it, or if you make it go this way, it'll actually slide, causing the thing to go, let's get this customization so we can get it done with. Alright, so we're gonna do this, but I mean, if y'all wanna see me, watch me customize, y'all can get a drill and put rear riders. There have been some fails in the past. I did a Lamborghini Super Custom, and what happened is it I was trying to like swap interiors with the Maesta one. The drill on that Maesta one, I put too much pressure, and it actually went that way. Went through the back windshield of the Lamborghini Aventador, and slid right into my hand, and I was bleeding for like almost an hour. I lost about half of my blood in my grand in my. In my I was like, oh no, I'm going to die today or something. Thankfully, y'all didn't see that because that was very bloody. Like, very, 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 like, blood and everything. But, uh, I'm really hoping this Audi Supra goes well because I got to do a wheel swap with a Toyota Supra if I can find it. I don't know where the toy is. Oh, there it is. Like, I'll leave my cars on spun so I can take the wheels off of them and, like, like, unfortunately, this is my only Toyota Supra. Man. Yeah, if you've seen on, uh, What's that guy? Uh, Wheels and Things or something? On his channel, his video, he was trying to restore a cool red line. And the drill went through the back, into his finger, went to the bone. I cringed on that video because it was so painful. Like, But uh, if you do it too much, it'll go through. Like, it'll put a hole in the surrounding plastic. If you do it too lightly, it'll take forever. Do it just right, and then you'll get the perfection and stuff. But uh, look at that. As you can see, the rivet. Also, my DeLorean. If you didn't notice, I don't know if Robert King has seen the video or not, but I found the Super DeLorean in Walgreens. You just have to turn your head sideways to view the video because, yeah, there's people in there. And I didn't want to get caught, and I want spy glasses so badly. Man, there's some of the bigger rivets, like. Like, the rivets that stand out more, they're, like, easier to get rid of and flatten out. Yeah, this customization may hopefully be fast. Whoa! There we go. That's why you should never put it like that. Okay, this one's probably a big, fat failure. Alright, you just saw that. I regret saying failure. This project is going to be great. You guys, look at that. Look at that big hole. Dang it. Well, at least I still, at least it didn't go through the windshield into my finger, though. I mean, alright, bye, Diecast Cars Garage. Be sure to like the live stream, man.
I'll check out your live. Wait. You should do a Friday Night Live diecast chat, man. I think you're getting in the mood to do one or something. But, uh, this was a failure, though. This thing failed. It went through. I think what happened... I put too much pressure on the car going this way, and... It slid out that way, so... Now that we have that over with... How did I do with that thing, that tool? There is this tool I used. Oh, there it is. Hiding on my back, but... Once I get it... But, once I do this, I will... Slide it in there. Ooh, yes. And then, the car will come apart. Normally. Oof. Oof, come on. Wait. I'm gonna risk it, guys. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. I'm risking my own life for doing this now. This Audi tried to kill me. Alright, oh, guys. I might... Oh, please don't break the base. I'm really hoping the base doesn't break off this thing. Yep, risk it. Oh, yes. Thankfully, the base did not break. I was so scared about that. Oh, look at that hole. He has a big hole. No, I tipped over my bucket. Now I gotta... Oh, my gosh, my bucket keeps tipping over. Now I gotta... Let's get the metal shavings to the side. I'll collect them later. There's our interior. There's our interior. Our windshield. And there's our interior. I keep on getting confused. There's our wheels. Now we get to the Audi. Now wish me luck on this Audi because... This one, I'm going to get the wheels from that Advan Porsche. I'm going to get two Advan Porsches just for the back wheels. We'll solve it for the Audi. There goes, found it. I'm going to try to go slow on this one. As you can see, it was trying to slide on me. Right there, you can see it. I'm trying to go slow because I'm kind of afraid that if this Audi fails, the only way it'll try to kill me is if the drill bit slides right here goes through the sunroof into my hand but if it was a lamborghini inventador with a back windshield ouch the killer lamborghini just tr killed me or something they killed try to kill me i was kind of scared that it actually went through my hand at first i was like oh crap it went through my hand ow ow luckily i didn't film it's also a good thing but uh yeah we're doing a wheel change on the alley you will look ugly I'm hoping this thing becomes a Kmart edition. Front rivet. I don't know if you can hear me or not. Right. Or a Mustang, yeah. I mean... Sometimes doing wheel swaps is very risky business. Man, the freaking area like on the surface where it's the rivet's at, it's actually getting pretty hot getting really hot but uh yeah I like I, I gotta take the things off here yeah, yeah friction if, you, if I get really fast yeah I'm gonna need my charge to drill up here in a little bit but uh man Man, I heard in Chicago, if you don't know, when it was freezing cold, they set the railroad tracks on fire. And the trains went right over the fire because if they didn't do that, the train tracks would shrink, be very friction, like be slippery, covered in ice, and they'll break under the train's weight and expand contrast and then it breaks, cracks, and then the train derails. But, uh... It's been a while since I've actually done a railroad video on my uh, Lone Star Rail Fan. That's the other channel that I like about trains better. Yeah, that one. Yeah, switches would move as well. Also, they did that because also the train tracks shrink if they're not heated. Man, they should have done a live rev, 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 rail cam in Chicago when they were doing that. I don't know if a virtual rail fan has done that yet. I subscribe to his channel. 
but oh yeah that one it was very cold up there i mean right now it's like negative 10 degrees in uh bismuth like what is that uh what is that place called uh montana billings montana negative 12 degrees Burr. but uh all right let's see if this thing's unspun uh, stick Audi's trying to kill me. And the Audi's trying to kill me right now. I'm gonna stick it in there. I'm gonna try not to bend the wheels because I'm gonna save these wheels for later. Dang, that's cold. That's cold. I'm not even lying. That's cold. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. She doesn't spin. Uh, are the wheels coming off? I think the wheels are coming off. Come on, guys. What's up this Audi? <laughs> Does not be the next killer. Like, n like not in the, the, the because if it tries to kill me. I'm gonna immediately turn off the live stream. And y'all can hear me moaning in pain because the Audi was trying to kill me, and I was like, "This is the Audi squad for trying to kill me." Man, I'm trying to see if this thing's unspun. Yes. Now I can put rear riders on this Audi. Hopefully if I can find any. There's the interior of one Audi. There's the windshield of one Audi. And there's one naked body. Well, half naked, but uh... Let me get rid of all the shavings off my desk. Okay, guys. So I'm moving the camera over. That's because I'm trying to get rid of the shavings. Move that drill over to the side right now. Move the car parts over to the side right now. Because I have to sweep the uh, shavings into this uh, tub right here. But don't leave yet. It's only going to be like about 10 seconds of me sweeping these shavings on in this uh, bucket here. Oh, I dropped it. Well, I bought another Audi. Don't worry about that. I know who's found the Super Audi. Wait, I don't know. Robert King, if you, if you, if you, uh. Alright. Alright, I'm almost done. Boom. Uh, five seconds. Uh, done. Well, that didn't take long, but I'm going to go grab my Super DeLorean. This is basically the game is. Been a Walmart, he took all Don't worry, Robert. I'm coming with the super right now. There it is. His base. It should have been a Walmart Zamac because they could have put. Where's that? Where's that screw? Like I got it. The screw. Like there should have been the Zamac logo right here, and erase the TH and make it a Zamac, and then replace it with the Screen Time series. Which car should have been the super? Uh, uh kit, kit. <laughs> well, that sucks, but uh, my pets are kind of big, but uh, but the super should have been the uh, kit from Knight Rider. I would love to see that, or even the at least they could have put Rear Riders on it. But there's your symbol at the super. Found it in Walgreens. It, right after the live stream ends, I highly suggest you should all go check out the video of me finding this in Walgreens. Well, no, but there's no Nissans. No Nissan Turbos, unfortunately. No Treasure Hunt Monkeys, which are very weird, but there's your TH. If I can zoom up on it, hopefully y'all can see it better. It's right there. It's basically a Zamek. There's your TH. There's your Circle Flame logo right there. Look at that. Zamek. I don't know, y'all should all go check out Walgreens. I'm gonna go put this back on my wall. I'm not gonna open it. No, 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 no. Okay guys, I'm back with the TT. Spoiler alert. TT pickup. Custom super. The only thing I got wrong is the top. I'm nearly finished. Literally just listen to the I know you have treasure hunts though. Watch the wheels. Watch these wheels. These wheels are the adjustable wheels. Now watch. Uh <laughs> you pronounce the name well, but yeah. Watch this. See the wheels right now, they're in the uh, they're in the regular form. Uh, right here. Now watch. Now watch this. Boom. See that? If you find this super, if you find more than one, I highly suggest to crack open one. The wheels on this thing are fun to play with. Oh my gosh, this is annoying. Oh my god. I even got the brown special thing right Set this T2 to the side right now. 
But not to get onto the real channels. Gotta punch the holes in the Audi here. Right there. Right there. Same thing with the other Audi Quattro. But dang, we're, we're actually taking those off of two Audis. Oh, this one went in deep. Now it's time to take the wheels off. First, remove the wheels from the Audi. Whatever it does, come on. I love T2 Pickup Super now. I thought it was going to be very bad. Right in here. I think... Well, I think some Walmarts are getting D-case now. But most of them are getting C-case. Oh, there you go. But, uh, there's one wheel. Alright, now time to remove the other wheel. There you go, like that. Two wheels removed. Man, I need to get that, uh, Super Treasure on Dodge Demon. The Super Treasure on Dodge Demon is nice. And immediately when it starts selling, I'm going to buy it from Malaysia. And do a full review on it. Now oh, I got my knife over here. Try not to get stabbed. I don't want to get stabbed. I don't know how pretty it's out of it, but it's very, very, very nasty. Yeah, but... Only Walgreens have E-case. And the Walmarts have, like, the A-case and the B-case. I need to go to Walmart do a Walmart peg hunting video. Here, hopefully I can do one this weekend. I might not be able to do one this weekend, but uh, I need to find that Super Treasure Hunt Corvette and the T2 so I can compare it to that. But uh, try to see if I can get these uh, fat pliers in here. Let's see, let's see. Nope, I'm watching Charlie Brown right now. I'm watching the Valentine's Day episode right now. Right. Yeah, auto parts stores, they sell little tiny bits of Hot Wheels cars. AutoZone, O'Reilly's. But O'Reilly's has a bigger selection though. There we go. <gasps> Sorry for the hiccup there. Good morning, Drifter. It is time to wake up. <laughs> I still have that. It's like, that episode that Drifter came out with, the Hot Wheels human alarm clock. Yeah, that was funny. Good morning, Drifter. It is time to wake up. It's get up. Time to wake up. If you do not wake up in the next three seconds, I will drop your Hot Wheels Nissan GTR Tanner Guaxilla. And he was like, uh, drop it, whatever. <laughs> and Drifter D's quite a funny guy. Go check out his channel. Then we have four people here. Yeah, that's surprising. That is surprising. But now we're wheel swapping an Audi. Everyone does. Yeah, I'm watching the Charlie episode of uh, Hello Mike Dyson. Be sure to like the stream and welcome to the stream. How's your day been going? And I hope you have been having a good day. But uh, we got the. Oh, yes. Yes, I got the custom. Oh my gosh. Should I do more work on the interior or does it look fine? Quite a dusty car. Uh, just me. The Audi is a pretty dope car to get. If you don't have an R, this Audi is freaking nuts. I dropped the windshield. I think Drifter D. Uh, yeah, Drifter D just dropped his Zakona Zega Agera R. It made me laugh, but uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, the truth. Dang, that thing is so sick. Yes. Beautiful. Audi. Man, this Audi. Looking like a sweet thing. Now, there we go. Dang, the wheels look dope on it now. There's only one. No! Let's see if the Quattro. That was a pretty good, decent thing to do. Yeah, it's freezing in here in Texas. We're getting sleep here. We're getting a small amount of sleep right now. We're urging, uh, like, in Kansas City, they got snow. I don't know what happened to the La Plata, La Plata, Missouri cam, but something's up with that. 
They need to get that cam fixing. It is a cold weather. You're getting snow. Man, I wish we had snow down here. We got snow back here in 2017. It's been nearly two years. No, but it's been nearly a year since we got the snow, brother. I think I would rather have snow than sleet and rain, if you ask me, because the snow, you can make Hot Wheels in the snow video, because it's really nice. But when the snow melts, you get freezing roads. And then freezing roads equals accidents, which equals injuries, which means injuries, which means deaths, which means total losses of automobiles, but uh, there's the interior. Do you think I'm gonna detail that roll cage right now? I don't watch how good I detail cars. I do this. I do that. I paint it with the Sharpie marker. And there we go. Yeah, I'm watching that Charlie Brown that Valentine's Day episode. Okay, what else needs to be detailed on this car? Let me know. Let me know. Seats. Yeah, I'm gonna detail the seats though. See how detailed the car looks right after this video. I might need to buy rear riders from the shop. Yeah, the sleet is going to be bad, but then there's going to be like some snow. Yeah, I've been watching the news, but I'm watching that Charlie Brown episode. Boom! Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, let's see if the wheels fit. Wait, I should have put rear riders on it. Dang it. Man, they need to do Roblox car series. Are you sure I'm not doing it the wrong way? This Audi Quattro though is tripping today. Uh oh. Man, they all kissing on that channel. They all kissing on that show. They kissing on each other. What the? The Super Bowl was sucky. The Super Bowl was the worst one in history. Yay! Alright, there's your wheels. Alright guys, there's the wheels on the Quattro. Alright. Alright, Robert King, see you tomorrow, man. I'll be ending this live stream probably right after this. But this really depends, but I'm gonna see this. I'm making look at this out here. I need to make it look like the Super. The Super Treasure. I really adore the Super. This one's like the most plainest looking Super of 2018. There you go. It's not focusing. And there we go. Oh my. I forgot where I put my markers at. Should I put rear riders on it? Or should I leave these wheels on it? Time to vote, guys. Time for y'all to argue with each other. Should I, A, leave the real rider, leave these wheels on the Audi? Two, put the normal wheels back on this Audi. Or three, put real riders on it. Which one? Or D, buy some more real riders to put on this Audi and experiment with them. And put the real riders on the Toyota Supra, which will probably look very bad. I'll let y'all guys decide on that. But, uh, this is the nicest wheel swap I've ever freaking done this Audi is dope if I might actually buy one you okay if you're an Audi R6 Avant fan and you're in the US and you really want to get one in real life well spoiler alert well unfortunately they said you, you can't buy one of these in the US no they're not available in the US they're available overseas but this is the nicest wheel swap I've ever done. But so you have to buy one from the UK mostly, Germany. This thing is really nice looking. Like I love this Audi. It makes me think of the Supra at first. But like, it really does make me think of the Supra. Like, ooh, Super Trish and Audi R6 Divine. I'm gonna go get some better wheel riders for these guys. Yeah. This is my custom supercharger at Tesla Roadster. Why did my chair just do that? First up, I'm going to put this big TH on the back. I'm going to put the TH on the back. Okay guys, there's your TH. 
And I just ruined my Sharpie. Okay, why would you look at that? Custom Supercharger on Tesla Roadster. Inspector Flame. I don't know if I can take you. I can. Yay! Yeah, I take the ruler off of this, baby. Now the Super goes without wheels once again. This thing has been a super pleasure. Swap her forever. I'm making sure the wheels will look really good on this thing. Oof. Alright guys, here we go. I need to buy a Santa from Malaysia. I have to go to work tomorrow. Like, I have job in school. I have jobs. Fr Monday through Friday. And jobs. Sunday and Saturday, making three hundred dollars. Right, here we go. Let's see it. Let's see it. Ooh, heck yes! Dang, this is a really nice smell. Look at this. Man, I love this thing. Now I'm making myself love this thing more than ever. But I have to take pictures of this and put it on Instagram. Which card needs these for this one? I'm not the Tesla Roadster, it'll look ugly with the wheels on. Alright, it'll look ugly with the wheels on. Uh, should I put it? There's like so many cars around my area. Like, I have cars with no wheels everywhere. I have a BMW with no wheels on. Should I? I don't know, guys. Take the wheels, put these wheels in the BMW for now. Let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. Uh, Yes, they fit. Alright, guys. Customizing. My favorite hobby. What? Yes. This thing's gonna get a custom paint job here pretty soon. But, yeah, this thing's gonna get a custom paint job. And I gotta put a black top roof on this thing. I might put a big wing on this thing and make it a wide body. It's gonna take some time, but I gotta shred down my shavings. Like steel wool. Steel wool right here. We're gonna go ahead and uh, check out my Countach and how it's doing. My custom RLC Countach with the opening doors. I'm kinda nervous about this one. This one's gonna be an ugly casting. Look at the interior on this one. Yeah, I'm kind of watching the uh, Charlie Brown Valentine today episode. Wait, wait, wait. Oh man, this guy doesn't have wheels on him again. Oh, I don't have wheels, but the... Listening to that sound of the wheels. Listen to it. I'm used to that sound. If y'all know, I'm used to it. You gotta film these details right here. <laughs> I'm watching that episode. It's so funny right now, but uh, three hundred dollars. Yeah, three hundred dollars. The candy gasser is the ultimate king of Hot Wheels. Like, right next to the red lines, people are selling that thing on eBay for a thousand dollars. That's as much as like a cheap car, literally. It's a Hot Wheels car, and it's as much as a freaking car. A real one, actually. I'm like, what? That's way too much for a car, actually. We're looking around, making sure I didn't forget. Do not forget. Might enable this enable flash so that you can see it really good. I think the glare is kind of too glary. not focusing. There you go. Come on, focus. Yay, there you go. Custom Audi. Look at that baby. Gotta write the TH logo on the back right now. Yeah, I've done my own gasser actually. 
I've, I've done it. I'm making sure I get this TH right because one false movement. And it's all messed up. Focus, 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 please. Well, the camera has a hard time focusing. It doesn't like me. Oh, no. Oh, no. I knocked down my basin. Come on, focus on my Audi. Guys, we're having focusing issues. Oh, I'm gonna zoom in. It focus when it zooms in. Guys, we're having focusing issues. Oh. Now time to enable flash again. Wait. There we go. There's our TH. Wait. The TH came out like a bad one. Put those wheels on it. Oh man, now I gotta I, I gotta have to take the wheels on the Supra with the Audi Quattro. Dirty Supra interior. And now I gotta take these wheels all of it. Uh, we're gonna experiment with these wheels, guys. Let's see if these wheels look good on it. We're experimenting with different types of wheels on this Audi. Like there will be that one right wheel where the Audi will fit on the Audi and stuff. I'm really praying that these wheels are right here. We're just doing customs and we just got done cracking open. I'm kind of cool. What do you think about these wheels? Good, yeah, they don't look good. Oh my gosh. Alright, that didn't look good. Mouty. Spoiler alert right there. I kind of like these wheels on the Audi, honestly. So we're gonna do this. Alright, let's see. I think I kind of like these wheels. Look at those, the JEM blue riders. Right, I'm gonna wait till I'm like but I'm gonna put these wheels. I gotta take these off the BMW. Those just came out. And put them on the Toyota Supra. Toyota Supra basically turn them out. Alright guys, I'm back again. Got a Camaro RFZ here. I put these there on this wheels. Right, these wheels don't look really good. But the next wheels will look really good. These ones will look good. And then they're lasting. These are a... We are doing these. We're doing this one tonight. Oops, oh no. Wait, don't tell me. What? Are you saying that, uh... No, they don't fit, but they would look good. They would look really good on the car. But wah, 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 they don't fit. There's a big bummer. I'm making sure that these air discs will really go on this Toyota. You gotta go on the Toyota. Now let's uh, get that interior. Right here. Uh oh, uh oh. Wait, it's still zoomed in. Oh, I didn't know it zoomed in. My custom Toyota Super out here. Well, unfortunately, there is going to be no more Supers because Toyota Hot Wheels lost their license to Toyota because JDM hoarders were going after too many Toyotas and they're like, we're going to cut the Toyota, some of the JDM cars. And that's what they did. The life of JDM now denied. 
It's never been as good. You got an Ali crotch over there, that's really good. Ooh, come on. Come on, guys. Ah! Alright, guys, here we go. We're gonna whip swap this baby. Put baby in the loose. I'm kind of thinking. Oh, I don't know about that. Whoa, that looks really nice. I kind of like that. I think I still the wheels over that way. Oh. That's a BMW. I have so many unspun cars. Like. They're gonna be abandoned here pretty soon. This Iraq Z you see here. You're gonna make it look abandoned. <laughs> Oof. Guys, we're making abandoned customs. The Loring is an abandoned custom. Oh man, we got some rulers right here. Oof. Do, 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 do. These blue riders are single. We got some no wheels we can put on some cars. I'm kind of thinking which ones do we, these wheels would go on, but uh, I'm kind of thinking like where should they go? Oh. I'm kind of thinking Tesla. I'm gonna put these wheels on the Tesla Moto Roadster. Guys, the Model 3 is coming out. <laughs> There's only been one photo of it. I think there has been. I'm not completely sure on that. Raptor Custom. Uh, we're getting progress in this thing. I'm kind of glad I opened up all them cars, but now I got some new wheels. I'm going to go ahead and get the wheels right here. I got to find a spot to put these wheels in. Man, there's like a lot of places. I'm gonna put on here to the side for now. Uh, I'll put them in the baggie. Yeah, I put them in the baggie. But uh, I got the shaving box here. This Camaro project has been going on for a month now. This Camaro, I'm gonna have an opening hood on it here pretty soon. Well, this thing's gonna look pretty nice. Face is all messed up on this thing. Look at this. Yeah, someone messed up the base in this thing. Look at that. Poor Camaro, though. So, this, see this, guys? Whoa. Guys, you can see this Camaro. I gotta find a metal base version of this one. Which means I may have to spend more money on buying one just to get a metal base Camaro. And switching it. And now let's see if it'll work. Oh, if we can maybe put rear riders on it. What kind of thing about rear riders? Let's see, let's see. Hmm. How does that look? I'm gonna try to get the interior of this Camaro. Along with the move the wind should be. I gotta find that a windshield piece of this Camaro. Oops, wrong way. I hope it, I'm hoping it's gonna fit. Guys, let's hope it fits. There he goes. So this Camaro custom's gonna come out really good. It's already half done. All it needs is tires on it. Front tires on it. But, uh, got the Audi finally. Super custom. I think I might end off the live stream here. Okay. 
Not too sure about that, but it's taking me these cars here. But I'll see y'all guys again later. Probably do. I'm really hoping we get to go hunting.